Next, I'm going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main method. Here after that coincide. So right here, I've created a scanner class object as a by using new keyword a scanner system class dot in. Here after I've taken add here four integer variable. First is n. Here after x max. And next, mean. Here after, array type or variable, integer array type variable, a double r, and I have given the size 66. So maximum you can enter 66 elements into the array. If you want more, then here you can increase the size. So next variable is a double r. And here after control comes to this point, system class dot r dot print method. So whatever in double code that is print to the output screen, enter array size. And here whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by n. So I'm going to enter n value 5. Here after system class dot r dot print error method. So this r is print to the output screen. Here control comes to follow. So at your x value initialized to 0. That check the condition 0 less than n value 5. Condition is true that coincide. So right here, system class dot r dot print method. So this r is print to the output screen. x value is now 0, 0 plus 1. So the value is 1 plus column. So the output display or oh, this value is displayed to the output screen. Enter elements 1 column. And whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by a double r one position. So this is uh, a double r. Oh, sorry, x is zero. So a double r zero position. So I'm going to enter four. So a double r zero sc dot next in. So whatever. Uh, string value is. Uh, come so that convert into next int integer by using next int method sc dot and uh, that go to a double or zero position so a double or zero position i into four here after loop continue so x increase x is one check the condition one less than five condition is true that coincide System dot r dot print. So again, the or uh, this or display into the output is enter element. So x value is now one one plus one two. So the output display enter element two column, and whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by a dot r x value is one. So one person element. So I enter one person. I'm going to enter twelve. Here after x increase again. Uh, so right here, check the condition, 2 less than 5, condition is 2, again that coincides, so the, this or this print to the output screen, enter elements of or uh, 2 plus 1, 3 column, and here, uh, what do I am going to enter, so that received by 8 or uh, 2 position, so this is uh, 2 position, so right here, uh, I am going to enter 6, now again x increase, so x is 3 now, Check the condition 3 less than n value 5 condition is 2. So again, system cross dot r dot print. So this or display into the output screen enter elements 3 plus 1 for column and here after what I am going to enter so that received by a of r 3. So this is a of r 3. So at here I am going to enter 16. Here after x increase, so x is now 4. Check the condition for less than 5, condition is true, that coincide. So again, system dot r dot print, so enter the element 4 plus 1, 5 column. So the output display, enter element 5 column. And what am I going to enter? So that received by a double r 4 position. So this is a double r 4 position. Here I am going to enter 9. Here after x increase, so x is now 5. Or uh, check the condition 5 less than 5 condition is not to not coincide here after control comes to this point. 
so it will all zero position value go to max so zero position four so four go to max here after it will all zero position value go to mean so mean is now four here after control comes to this point so x start from zero again here check the condition zero less than five condition is true so right go inside so right here if a double or zero position greater than max so zero position a double or zero position four is there and max value is four four greater than four condition is not to not coincide here if a double or zero position less than mean so four less than four condition not to not coincide so here after that go on and increase the value of x so x is now one check the condition one less than n value five condition is two so at if a double or one position so one position is 12 greater than max value four so 12 greater than four condition is two so a double or x value is one one person value go to max so 12 comes to max here after if a double or 1, so 1 person is 2 and less than mean. So mean value is 4. 12 less than mean condition is not to not coincide. Here after x increase. So x is 2 now. Check the condition 2 less than 5 condition is 2. So that coincide. So right here if a double or 2, so 2 position is 6 greater than and Max value is 12. 6 greater than 12. Condition is not true. So that not coincide here. If a double or x value is now 2. So a double or 2 position 6 or less than 6 less than mean value 4. 6 less than 4. So this condition also not true. So not going inside here after x increase. So x is now 3. Check the condition. 3 less than 5. Condition is true. So if a double or 3 position. So 3 position is 16. Greater than max value is 12. 16 greater than 12. Condition is true. That coincides. So at a double or 3 position. X is 3. 3 position value go to max. So 3 position is 16. 16 go to max. Here after control comes to this point if a double or x so a double 3 position 16 less than 4 condition is not to not coincide here after x increase so x is now 4 check the condition 4 less than 5 condition is true that coincide so here if a double or 4 position so 4 position is 9 and max value is 16 9 greater than 16 that's not to not coincide here if a double or 4 so 9 less than and mean value 4. 9 less than 4 condition is or not to not coincide here after x increase. So x is now 5. Check the condition 5 less than 5 condition is not true. So that not coincide here after control comes to this point. So I tell system class dot all dot print man, print error method. So new line print error method. So new line that display mean so the whatever in code double code so that display and here the mean value so four so mean four and here after system dot r dot four or r dot print error so max so this display output screen the value of max so 16. so at your output display max 16 and here after that output main method so this time i into this all elements so you can enter any element so if you give n value 6 so here you have to enter total 6 elements into the array so this time you can try to enter 2 and do the same try and method so definitely you will get the expected output so this time minimum value mean value is now 2 that come so suppose so when if a double r so at your 5 position that come so a double or 5 position less than mean so 5 position is 2 2 less than 4 condition is true so that coincides so at your a double or 5 position go to mean so 2 come and here after that display mean 2 so this is the dry end method of this program so i hope guys you understand so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week